Zillac is helping our performance grow. We jumped in Zillac on May 29th, and we have just been astounded by what we've been able to achieve. Let's talk about it. Hi everyone, welcome back to The Journey, and I am Gerald Cannon. As a reminder, I am not a financial planner, nor is this financial advice, and I'm not your financial advisor. To stay up on everything that's happening here at The Journey, be sure and hit that subscription button if you have not already done so, and give this video a thumbs up, and hit that bell to be notified of all future uploads. I will always leave links to the programs I am participating in under the video in the Show More area. If you'd like to move forward with any of those programs, make sure you take your time and do your due diligence prior to investing in any of those programs. Other interesting videos will be linked at the end, so please watch till the end. Thank you all for watching. Let's log on to the computer and see how things are going with our passive earnings with Zillac. Okay team, let's log on on Zillac and let's see what's going on with the account. All right, uh, $659.75 is in our account balance. As a reminder, to join the Easy Plan, it takes $200 to join Zillac, which would put you on the Easy Plan, earning 2.5% per day for six days. That averages out to be 15% at the end of six days. Your money is free after six days. It's tied up for those first six days to earn that 2.5%. The way I figure out what I can invest, everyone, is I go over here to withdraw because the money that's in your account balance can be withdrawn. I can now withdraw $128.92 in Bitcoin and $530.82 in USDT. So since I'm not looking to pull any money out, I have pulled money out and there was no issues in pulling money out. I'm going to go over here now to deposit and I'm going to remember that number 530 as far as USDT. Once it comes over to the deposit menu, I'm going to proceed to put the 530 on the easy plan. So I'm going to check this box here under the payment method and I'm going to put in 530 and I'm going to hit this black button that says deposit. That's going to allow me to put this money on stake and it starts 24 hours from the time I start. So that's when my six days will be up. So it's about five o'clock now, a little bit after five o'clock now. So let's just say it's 510. At 510, six days later, I will be able to unstake this, which will be Sunday. So with this proceeding on, we're expecting it to tell us, and it does, that the deposit has been saved successfully. Now, if I go back over to withdrawal, I have $129 and some change in the withdrawal area. So I could take out the $128.92 in Bitcoin. So if I want to withdraw money, I would do that. And I would come down here and I would enter $128 right there. And then I would proceed to hit the withdrawal button here. That is how you take out money when it's time to take out money. Prior to that, you will need to go to your profile here and you would need to put in your wallets. So I have wallets already entered in there and they're here. So once you put a wallet in here, that's a Bitcoin wallet and there's the USDT wallet. Then I hit update profile once I did that. If you run into any issues with the F2A not syncing once you're doing that, then unsync your F2A. Take it off for a minute, update these wallets, and then add it back. I had to do that earlier because when I came aboard, they didn't have F2A, and then later they incorporated it. Here's my join date here. I registered on May 29th at 4 p.m., I am on the East Coast, so there's my information there. And let's go back over now to transactions. Transactions, we're going to look at the earnings. I'm going to take a look at the earnings that were received on the 10th. So we will change this to just earnings. And we will find out what earnings 
what earnings we received during the 10th of July as soon as this comes up. So let me find the 10th of July, everyone, the beginning of it. Give me just a sec. There we go. I'm going to start with this 562. All of these were received on the 10th. $5.62. If you look to the right of the amount, it lists June, July 10th, and it tells you exactly what time period I received those. The monies that you just saw me lock up, that $530 in Bitcoin, let's say it was 5 o'clock when I locked it up, I will receive payment of 2.5% on that at 5 o'clock tomorrow and for the next five days after tomorrow for it to be a total of six days. So now let me go back to the numbers. $5.62 was received, $21.57, $5, cent. $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 $5 
that's where that goes. And then if you want to go from the master plan to the gold plan, that's a $100,000 um, installment. And it's 3.5% daily. On these two plans, the master and the gold plan, you can take out money after your time has expired and never put money in again. On the easy plan, everyone, if you put in $200, it's earning $5 a day. At the end of six days, you have $30. You can take that $30 out and renew your $200 plan. And now you're on the second time of doing this, so it's going to earn another $30. If you pull that $30 out, you have now earned $60 in the past 12 days. Zillac wants you to add something if you want to do the $200 again. Something being as small as, let's just say $20, everyone. Anything smaller than that, I don't even know if it's worth sending it. So let's say, for this example, you pull out your 30. That still leaves you with 200. The next time, maybe pull out 10. Because there's the minimum amount, 10. Now you've added that 20 that I mentioned. You now have $220 in your plan. And you can continue that plan for two times at the same amount of money if you take your money out on the previous two cycles. So hopefully a simple way to say that now that I've explained that is two times experimenting with $200. You need to add a little bit or leave a little bit in there for the third time around. Now, if you join 200 and you just totally get out the program, then again, that wouldn't apply to you. Hopefully, I've covered all the bases that that answers and covers anybody's questions again. But just make sure you know you can't just stay 200 forever and not put anything in. All right, everybody. I am going to get out you all's hair and we will talk to you all on the next update.